Hello, hey everyone, welcome, welcome, nice to see you, let's get a game up here, unmuted, oh you can hear it, maybe, very faintly, let's see, can I get a capture too, maybe, I don't know, oh I sure can, hello, hey everyone, welcome, welcome, Hope you're doing, hope you're doing well this Sunday evening. Hope you're all doing swimmingly. It's nice to see you. I think it was a good time to play some some Dragon Age. Uh, get a bit more acquainted with the the jungle bits we're exploring right now. Well, not jungle bits, forest bits. <laughs> hope you're all doing well. Uh, I'm not uh, I'm not doing too bad today. I found Iron Brew today. I, I couldn't believe it. I um, so, uh, I figured I'd uh, check out a new shop. They shut down all the Sunday open shops here, so I had to go to these, uh, uh, like, mom and pop shops, which is nice. Um, good to see that they're getting a lot of a lot more business. And they had R and Brew, so that was a good time. <laughs> Everyone's favorite rust-flavored beverage. Yeah, I don't know what it's uh, flavored, actually. I guess rust-flavored might be <laughs> my <might be> accurate. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I, I, I actually have no idea what it's supposed to taste like, but it's... It's pleasant. It's nice. It's made from girders. <laughs> okay, gotcha. <laughs> Fair enough. Sure it is. Let's get in another game. We've been waiting long enough. We've been waiting forever. To... Was blasting music, trying to f configure this mod. So the delay that was, I, I was seeing if I could make the subtitles a bit bigger because. They're tiny. They're so small. <laughs> Little baby text. Um, uh, we'll see if uh, it needs to be bigger. At least I have the configuration tool now to make it bigger. So, if we had ever, at any point I feel maybe the subtitles are a bit small, uh, just let me know and uh, I can I can fix it. Oh yeah, oh yeah. You can definitely see that the text is bigger now. Yeah, it's uh, even going out of the frame a little bit. But you know what? That's fine. That's fine. That's the cost we pay for legibility. <laughs> as long as we can read it, I'm happy that it spills out of the box. That, that's fine. We're coloring a little bit outside the lines today. Let's see. So, I think this is wool. Oh my god, it's night and day. It's night and day. Yeah, like this stuff here was completely legible <laughs> in the last stream because <laughs> I, I i guess they just never figured that people would get like screens and resolutions this high and big um but uh i mean even even back then they would have been too small right i feel like it would have been too small still we can read nice if you all feel like you can read if, if you all feel like this is good then uh i'm, I'm best pleased I'm best pleased. Um, how's the audio? Is uh, is everything sounding all right? The game coming out fine and dandy. Am I coming out all right? Yes. <laughs> okay, good. Thank you. <laughs> I love to hear it. <laughs> That's amazing. Instant gratification on that one. <laughs> Uh, where, where am I? God, I love unit box and stuff like that, man. It, it, nothing beats a well-timed unit box. It's so it's so good. It's so good. <laughs> like playing an RTS and you ask yourself something and this immediately you get like absolutely owned by a canned response from a space marine. <laughs> I remember. I found something last time, which I, I should be mindful of while we're exploring here. Krokari Wiles, that's what it's called. This one. We found a will last time. Um, so we should be mindful that uh, I, I find something and return it to someone. Find a cash mentioned in the will. Well, let me know what the will is then, jeez. Let's uh, look at the note again, so we have it fresh in our minds. 
These day pranks? No, come on. Oh, it's gonna be hard to find anything, isn't it? Characters? No. Maybe we should sum up what happened last time. Yeah, I'll, I'll do that. So, we're all elf guy. We're in like a little elf guy slum in the city. And um, we got uh, kind of kicked out, kind of not. You got conscripted because we were a little elf guy jerk. Oh, but the guy deserved it, so we're not really much of a jerk, are we? Um, and now our new military guys are like, well, you should earn your keep, so we're going to send you out in the jungle. And here we are. <laughs> Uh, as the here it is, here it is. I leave all that I came with to my wife, Jetta. Should a read of this note feel charitable, I have buried a sealed lockbox in our camp, nestled in a Tevinta rune in the western reaches of the wilds. Okay, 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 okay. Look for a little rune to the west. Look for a little lockbox. And then we should return that to Rigby's wife in Redcliffe. We can do that. We can do that. Or will we? Nah, we can do that. Western. Okay. Oh, hang on. Chase and trail sign. That was a thing, wasn't it? Because, um... I think that's like some sort of culture that used to inhabit these forests. And I guess these, they left behind like little trail signs that uh, let you know if uh, there's something cooler, right? So, I guess if I have that on my map, there must be something there, right? Is it here? Nope. I already found this one, I think. What did I? No, this is somewhere else. Never be, it will ever be more than 720p serial face. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this was um, like at around 720p time, wasn't it? This was also around like where 1080p was kind of. Like, you know, you're reaching for 1080p, right? I think this was random. Especially if you were playing consoles. I've got a very PC-centric perspective on uh, how, like, the technology went. But, um, I think for a while, the consoles were, like, upscaling to 720p, right? 1080p with them was, like, 4K now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why would he ever need 1080p? This is too many pixels. That being said though, 4K is just too many pixels, by the way. And I think that's a sincere opinion I have. <laughs> I think. I have 4K on uh, my TV. Um, I haven't been able to really utilize it to, like, you know, it's it's full be for those benefits, I don't think. I don't, I don't know how many 4K things I played on it. I don't really have a PS5, you know, I don't have PS4 Pro, so I don't think I've played anything 4K on it. I might have seen, like, a YouTube video 4K on it. Um, that being said, I feel like I don't notice too much difference between my uh, 4040p monitor and my, and my TV, you know? I think I'm perfectly sated and satisfied with my 4040p. I think you can stop there. Put the stop sign down. No more resolution allowed. It's saying chastened sign here, but I don't quite know what I'm looking for. Unless these are the Tevinter ruins. Oh, hidden cache. Going. Oh my god, look how legible it is. Oh my god, this is shockingly legible. <laughs> it's amazing. Thank you, James. Thank you for letting us know there's a mod out there that will make our life so much easier. Uh, yeah, take the lock box to be to Jetta. Absolutely, yeah. We don't we don't need to pillage this to the box. There's, there's there's gonna be enough goodies pillaged from orcs and goblins. I I don't need to take anything from Jetta or Rigby. I, no worries. I don't know who they are, but, uh, you know, I don't need it. It's just gonna be like leather armor. Rugged leather armor. I've picked up so many rugged leather armors now, uh, I don't need it. I think you could uncurse the resolution now as well. Can tinker before next time, probably better. I have already uncursed my resolution. So, 
I'm not uh, running the game in a tiny little window anymore. I'm running in a big window. I'm not running it in full screen though, because we, <laughs> well, I, at least I remember how what happened then when I ran this game in full screen. It it crashed. <laughs> immediately crashed. <laughs> so don't do that. Uh, I'm trying to figure out where to go. I think I just have to go south now. I'll, I'll try going east um, first just to see if I, like, I can avoid getting owned. We got owned here. I got owned. I, sh I shouldn't make you complicit in this owning. I got uh, turned into a corn cob. Uh -oh. I turned this into a corn cob TV segment. I didn't rig shit. Um, so I don't want to repeat that necessarily, but I think I have to. Yeah, I have to. I'm gonna have to run through Orc Wizard Pass again. Oof, oof, oof. If I press this, do you just sit there? You don't. Quiet now. Is there a chance I can just stealth through this? That'd be delightful. You can come over here at least. Thanks. I love that. Watch key. Hello. I'll be helpful. Uh, can't believe the combat works in the way it does in this game. Why do you enter combat when you perceive an enemy? Um, wouldn't it make more sense to enter combat when um, they perceive you? It's like. If I enter combat, I can't stealth anymore. It's frustrating. Ah, uh, that's where those guys show up from. That's where you're from, man. Oh my god, the old lamage again. Ah, you can be free tonight. Time for some fun! Yeah, because it's time for some fun. You got it. Yes. Oh. Okay, that was a lot easier than last time. Wait, these guys didn't stand a chance. They were so squishy. This window is so big, I, I love it. Like, these windows were, like, so tiny last time. They were, like, imperceptible. Very handy to turn into cloud and still just have the boys right behind you. Yeah, I, I don't I don't see the purpose of stealth yet, but maybe I just need to be bad at stealth. Maybe my character's just too bad at stealth. Like right now it feels like Oh I see. Hello. Oh shit. Uh don't go there. That, do not go in there. That's why we all got like pinned and died last time. There's the billion snare traps there. Yeah, that, that's why I got so owned. Uh, it was horrible. What is this camera? No, too rude. Get, get, get back here. Do you guys know what cover is? Point me. Point me. Point me on cover, please. Right. Is this cover? Aha. Maybe, kind of. Let's see if I can actually stealth on the mid. Um, I don't know. I think you gotta be a certain distance away from them. Oh my god. I ate shit. But at least I ate shit by myself, so it's not too bad, you know? No one knows I ate shit. No one needs to know. Don't tell them. Owie! Oh, that like swirly thing. That like rings some bells. What was that like, again? Is that like an aura thing? It's like Lee Chelf or something. So many snare traps though. Hey, that guy was a chump once we allowed us to hit him. Wow, they just dexterous to move around those traps. That's great. Thank you. Uh, just allow me to disarm these then. Well, um, you will. Do they real work? I can't quite tell where the hitbox is. Getting so much XP from this. Look at my XP bar. Oh, it didn't move very much, that one. 
20 XP just sounds like so much to me. <laughs> it doesn't move at all down there. Oh, barely. Oh my god, okay. <clears throat> I need 3,000 XP. 3,500 XP to, lo uh, to level up. So I guess 20 isn't that much. Never mind. You can just sound this thing still though. Come on. No, 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 no. Come on. Come on, dude. Come on. Just the sound the thing. Ah, oh, fuck. The summit, dude. This way, then. No? Thank you. It's disarmed. You're welcome to leave it now. Jeez. Oh! No, that's, that's my inventory. He had nothing. Why even allow me to loot him? I'm off. Except some local myths and legends. I wish you would let me just read this. Right from there. That'd be nice. My inventory's getting bogged down with sort of armor. Hopefully we are done with the segment soon so I can go back and uh, empty it. There's <laughs> definitely going to be some uh, goblins here, right? Yeah, you can hear them. They sound like bears for some reason. They're dead. Get him! Look, like my uh, my cat is not doing much right now. I guess it should be um, below the bell thing. Yeah, I should. Yeah, that's like one thing I can do. Is the bell. Once we get a level, uh, things will be different. So uh, then I can get the combat techniques thing. Uh, lightning's kind of nice. I think lightning could be worse. You know what? This game really does not look too bad for how old it is, right? Like, part of me like keeps forgetting how old this game is. I, I, I feel like it's it came out very recently. It didn't even come out that long ago. I keep I keep feeling, but it is like over ten years old now. I think almost at least, right? Did we agree that it was like 14 years old or something that's that? No, that can't be right. It's a while though. And it really could look worse than it does right now. If anything, this is the sort of graphics I'm very comfortable with. <laughs> I, just, I, I just like that things do look a bit like a game. Hang on, pile of rocks? What would a loot pile of rocks unless there was something important then? Uh, I'll sprinkle some ash on the pile of stones. yeah sure. Oh shit, I should not have done that. I summoned Gazara from Slumber. Boomer graphics, best graphics ever? Absolutely, honestly. I I feel like if you have, I, I think I said this last time, but I think if you have like slightly shitty graphics, it allows you some abstraction where you, which you can um, make up for a bit stylization. Yes. Of course, you can have stylized uh, photo realistic graphics as well, but like, I don't know, I feel like um, certain things look a bit distracting if you're trying to have a very photo realistic style. Any game on the uh, Xbox 360 that didn't look like one of us in mud was a notable outlier. <laughs> but don't forget, wet. The 360 was the wettest console. <laughs> like, um, Bioshock ha ha has to be the peak of like Xbox 360 graphics, right? Everything's just wet and muddy. <laughs> uh, Alistair's gonna friggin' die, dude. Reckon I can heal before he dies? <laughs> Yummy! Nice one. Not the way Gazaraf can prevent Alistair, Alistair from healing. Dude, I totally forgot that Alistair's a total psychopath. I, I was shocked and appalled at the things Alistair was saying last time. I was like, what? Why are you like this, Alistair? Why? Why are you like this? Yes. Ooh, boots. I can't wait to see, uh, hear some of the... Some of the little pearls of wisdom he has to uh, give... He's gonna give us today. I can't wait. It's gonna be, like, worse and worse stuff every time, I, I, I swear. 
Um, I don't think anyone really needs any armor or anything, do they? I think the only thing Alistair needs is like a splint mail hat so he can get the set bonus. He's got some set bonus now, but I guess only partial, maybe? I don't know how set bonus works. Is set bonus more like a, as a, a like, is it like a wow situation? Where there's like five pieces of armor that you could wear, but you only need like three. I don't know. This is guarded. Uh, I don't know if it's a binder thing or if it scales. Hmm. How come I don't have the set bonus actually? Oh, this. No, no, studded, studded, studded. I have all studded. How come I don't get the set bonus? It's because of my boots. I have my boots. It's like a mage boots for Matt. Cool. Love to get mage boots from a party of bunch of guys with sticks and stones and one guy that hates mages. <laughs> These guys aren't up to any tricks. I'm just gonna run at them. Look at them. There's one guy there, one big herlock he, that makes all of the rules. Uh, but other, otherwise, we get it. He did all three for the bonus thing. All three. Okay. Oh, so the hat just doesn't count for the set? You can do whatever you want for the hat? Because this is four. Because an Alistair has the set bonus, but he has a weird hat. So I guess the hat just doesn't count. I guess for the hat, you just choose whatever has the best stats or what looks the coolest. <laughs> probably, probably what looks the coolest. Especially when you're wearing a leather armor like this. Because they always make leather armor like just. That's the, the worst set of armor in all these fantasy games. You never want to be caught um, caught alive with any leather arm, uh, like leather hat on you. All right. I'll take some crystals. Yeah. Enchanted dogger, tier two. Demonic icor. Sure. Ooh, fire ammo. I okay, had some pretty cool stuff. Why did you have both arrows and bolts though? Why would you even? It's not a bit much. I feel like if I enter a place though, I'm gonna... I'm gonna maybe be escorted back to the camp. So I'm gonna loiter around a little bit more and see if there's anything more on the map. Doesn't appear to be. Cross the gloves and boots are the core thing. Okay. Fair, fair. I guess the hat being separated um, makes the most sense. I guess it makes more sense than boots being separated. No, there's nothing. Here. All right. Let's go on in and check what the, the fuss is all about. I do like that they automatically um, region everyone up uh, between fights. I guess like the, the difference here between like other CRPGs is that uh, you would typically have to spend a lot of time like healing up like this, right? Like you would spend like an hour or something in Baldur's Gate between fights if you want to alter the region like this. I don't know if time is was really ever important though. Well, well, what have we here? I'm a little guy. It's my birthday, you can't hurt me. Are you a vulture, I wonder? A scavenger, poking amidst a corpse whose bones were long since cleaned? Or merely an intruder, come into these dark spawn filled wilds of mine in search of easy prey? I swear she used to have more clothes on. What say you, hmm? Scavenger or intruder? Mm. Oh, I can't. 
I can't earnestly interact with a question? He's got to be on defensive like this? Come on, let, let, let me say scavenger. Or intruder. Or both. Let me see both. I, I am both. Let me see both. I'm, I'm not the first one. I, I would first, um, yeah, I would first know who you are and where you come from. Cotton Eye Joan. You are the intruder here. I believe the first question is rightfully mine. I have watched your progress for some time. Where do they go, I wondered. Why are they here? And now you disturb ashes none have touched for so long. Why is that? To summon Gazareth. She looks chaser. The consumer of ash. Others may be nearby. Oh, you fear barbarians will swoop down upon you. Yes. Swooping is bad. Unless we're She's vultures. She's a witch of the wild, she is. She'll turn us into toads. Witch of the wilds. Such idle fancies, those legends. Have you no minds of your own? You there. Elves are not frightened little boys. Tell me your name and I shall tell you mine. No, she was always like this. I guess I just, in my memory, I just dressed her up. <laughs> what is it? She's got like an H&M shirt on. You know how you, you like wear those things for like a week? You wash it, wash it like a couple times and the collar just expands to the point it reaches the navel like that? that <laughs> that's why she dressed like that. She just doesn't want to go clothes shopping again. <laughs> Hey, I'm, uh, I'm Dent. Pleasure to meet you. Now that is a proper civil greeting, even here in the wilds. You may call me Morrigan. Shall sure I think your purpose? You sought something in that chest? Something that is here no longer? Here no longer? You stole them, didn't you? You're some kind of sneaky witch thief. How very eloquent. How does one steal witch from thief. dead men? Quite easily, it seems. Those documents are Grey Warden property, Wait, that's and I a suggest corset? you turn them. What? I will not, for it was not I who removed them. Invoke a name that means nothing here any longer, if you wish. I am not threatened. Wait, hang on. Wait, I thought there was like a scar for a second. No, it like loops down like that into a corset. <laughs> what is she wearing? <laughs> that's insane. She has like Dark Souls pants on. <laughs> Dark Souls trousers. <laughs> She's toying with us. Let's go. Why so petulant? You wish to know who removed your papers? Twas my mother who did the deed. I also enjoy that she synced up her makeup with a, <laughs> with a cool shirt. <laughs> Is this a joke? If so, it seems the truthful rather than funny sort, no? Great. She's a thieving, weird, talking, funny sort of witch. Funny Not witch. Not all in the wilds are monsters. Flowers grow as well as toads. If you wish, I will take you to my mother. Tis not far from here, and you may ask her for your papers if you like. We should get those treaties, but I dislike this Morrigan's sudden appearance. It's too convenient. Hmm. Tell us more about your mother first. She prefers her privacy, but I imagine she will be curious enough why you were here. Come, see for yourself. Why are you so interested in helping us? Why not? I do not meet many people here. Are you all so mistrustful? Fair enough. I would also be bored if I lived here. I say we go with her. She'll put us all in the pot, she will. Just you watch. Jokes on you, I don't even fit in the forest. It'll be a nice change. Follow me. And I already had my pot for the day. She can't hurt me. I love you know I'm more dangerous with the pot than I am without. Greetings, mother. I bring before you four grey wardens who I see them, girl. Hmm. Much as I expected. Are we supposed to believe you were expecting us? You are required to do nothing, least of all believe. Shut one's eyes tight or open one's arms wide. Either way, one's a fool. She's a witch, I tell you. We shouldn't be talking to her. 
Quiet, Dabbit. If she's really a witch, do you want to make her mad? There is a smart lad. Sadly irrelevant to the larger scheme of things, but it is not I who decides. Believe what you will. And what of you? Does your elven mind give you a different viewpoint? What do you believe? I always love when they have, like, specific dialogue for whoever you're playing, and it, it, it feels so, like, inserted inappropriately. <laughs> it's like, oh, he got me a bit of a dialogue whiplash there. That was out of nowhere. I'm no fool, if that's what you're asking. Oh, if you must protest so quickly, perhaps I need not ask. So much about you is uncertain, and yet I believe. Do I? What does the elven mind what? believe? It seems I do. So this is a dreaded witch of the wilds. Witch of the wilds, huh? Morrigan must have told you that. She fancies such tales, though she would never admit it. Oh, how she dances under the moon. <laughs> they did not come to listen to your wild tales, mother. True, they came for their treaties, yes? And before you begin barking, your precious seal wore off long ago. I have protected these. You... Oh, you protected them. And why not? Take them to your Grey Wardens and tell them this Blight's threat is greater than they realize. Hey you, you're a player, race. What's your opinion on situation? Yeah, <laughs> exactly, yeah. And it, just the way it transitions into those lines as well is always so jarring. <laughs> Not always so jarring, but often. <laughs> um, what do you mean a threat is larger, greater than they realize? What Either you mean? the threat is more, or they realize less. Or perhaps the threat is nothing. <laughs> or perhaps they realize nothing. <laughs> oh, do not mind me. <laughs> you have what you came for. Time for you to go, then. Okay, bye. Don't be ridiculous, girl. These are your guests. Oh, very well. I will show you out of the woods. Follow me. Follow me. I'll lead the way. Well, that went well. I guess storing our important documents in a random place in the woods wasn't an amazing idea. I guess it does help if uh, just random witches uh, put them in the house instead. That does sound like a improvement. It's <laughs> a good change. Uh, before we do anything, I'm gonna give the antidote. To my doggo, my little now, buddy, my little doggo Let's buddy. Not get that herb I told you about. There's not much hope. I got it. Let me see. Yeah, that's exactly it. Wonderful. Yeah, give me a moment, and I'll make this into an ointment. <laughs> he looks better already. I'm sure he'd thank you himself if he could. How long before there's an improvement? A day, maybe two. There's enough ointment for him to make a full recovery. Why not come back after the battle? Perhaps we can see about imprinting him on you. You think that's possible? Maybe. It's likely he understands you're responsible for curing him. Mabari are at least as smart as your average tax collector. Come back after the battle and just... Or take another look. What a... Oddly specific sniper dogs, the Rude. Hey, Quartermaster. Hello again. Is there something you need? Some supplies, mm. perhaps? Hope you don't mind that I robbed, robbed you last time. Let's see what you have. Well, let me know what you'd like. Or rather, you can see what I have. And what I have is just lots and lots of leather armor. <laughs> uh, I already have these. You can have those. You can have that. You can have scale armor. You can have some chainmail. Yep, just take it. Just take it all. I don't. I don't need this stuff. Yep, thank you. I need to take my splint metal, yeah. I guess I can keep this shield. Hang on, hold on. Why am I so encumbered still? I just stole, uh, not stole, I, I just sold, sold. I just sold all my stuff. And I'm still 52, that's crazy. Is it uh, my weapons? All right, we can sell our tier one daggers. No need for that. Oh, I got the enchanted dagger. I need to equip that. Tier 1 sword, who needs it? Balance, great sword, nah. 
borrowed long sword. Okay, these are these things. Tier two sword. Tier one long sword. No, thank you. Little club thing. Nah, get out of here. Okay, this is going down. I'm just being encumbered by something. Oh no, it isn't just like a bunch of like trash, is it? How would I even know? Uh, I can't even swap a weight? Hang on. What actually weighs me down? Uh, it doesn't say anywhere how, how heavy things are. Wait, really? That's crazy. Yeah, it doesn't, it doesn't say how heavy it is. That's absurd. So I'm definitely being weighed down by all of this crap here, then. Is that a crafting in this game? Do I need to keep, like, wolf pelts? Gems. Totally forget. I know there's, like, potion making and stuff. So I can turn my elf root into, like, health potions, which would probably be good. I should probably get some flasks. Do you sell flasks? Oh, no, but he sells a backpack. Yes. Oh, nice. Very nice. It sells recipes, too. I guess I should get these recipes for, like, health bolts and less injury kit recipe. Let's imagine I might just have the lesser health poultice one right now. I could grab this. Probably smart. I don't think I want the money for anything else. I think I'm totally fine blowing my money on uh, just getting recipes and material supplies. A couple of flasks, there we go. Hang on, wait a second. Flasks, they don't weigh me down, do they? No, okay. I was a bit worried uh, about flasks, that um, they'd be heavy. Uh, but in that case, I can, uh, I can grab a ton of flasks. Then. There we go. Don't mind going broke. But I'd either. I'm good. I think we're gonna sell this clothing too. Indestructible? Why? Hey, get rid, get rid of this stuff. I don't need a wedding clothes either. Get out of here. Excellent. And while we're at it, why don't I just uh, take your stuff again? Thank you. <laughs> what you got? What you give me this time? Who even knows, dude? This game, for some reason, doesn't tell you what you steal. Oh, oh, hello, hello. No one's watching the box anymore. Huh. Got oh, maybe that tranquil guy, maybe he had the key. Oh, I have a key. see him. No, he doesn't. Maybe you have the key, Win. Do you have the key? We'll find out uh, in a couple seconds. Nope, just nothing to steal. Oh, I can actually go in here now. I couldn't do that before because they were busy with the the uh, spell that we cast them. They're like channeling some spell. But there's nothing in here, so. Ah, well. Yes, there's no key in there then. In my chest. Oh, blows. I just want to get into the chest. Oh, hang on, there's a note in there. What's that about? What is that? Oh, okay. I thought it was a massive poo. I think it's a dog. Sleepy dog, I guess. Note. On the role of dogs in Frelden society. Okay, I guess someone were doing the light reading in the. <laughs> Maybe the dog was doing some light reading before it passed out. Very self aware dog. Officer. You might have some cool stuff. Nope, nothing. Oh, someone's gonna have some stuff. Duncan. Duncan. Oh, I tried to steal from Duncan last time. Maybe I'll fare a bit better this time. Ah, failed. A lot of people don't mind if you fail so stealing you from them. It's the great. Have you been successful? Uh, we have. Good. I've had the circle mages preparing. With the blood you've retrieved, we can begin the joining immediately. The joining. 
Maybe we should tell you about Morgan and her mother. There was a woman at the tower and her mother had the scrolls. They were both very... odd. Were they wilder folk? I don't think so. They might be apostates. Mages hiding from the Chantry. I know you were once a Templar, Alistair, but Chantry business is not ours. We have the scrolls. Let us focus on the joining. Now will you tell us what this ritual is all about? I will not lie. We Grey Wardens pay a heavy price to become what we are. Fate may decree that you pay your price now rather than later. Is that for the journey is so secret? If only such secrecy were unnecessary and all understood the necessity of such sacrifice. Sadly, that will never be so. Let's go then. I'm anxious to see this joining now. I agree. Let's have it done. Then let us begin. Alistair, take them to the old temple. Not ominous at all. I'm sure it'll go totally fine the more for all I hear of us. about this joining, the less I like it. Are you blubbering again? Why all these damn tests? Have I not earned my place? Maybe it's tradition. Maybe they're just trying to annoy you. All humans, such cowards. I only know that my wife is in Hyover with a child on the way. If they had warned me, I... It just doesn't seem fair. Would you have come if they'd warned you? Maybe that's why they don't. The Wardens do what they must, right? Including sacrificing us? I'd sacrifice a lot more if I knew it would end the Blight. But we don't know that, Dav. Oh. No. Hmm. You know what? Will you both shut up? Yes, yeah, Sir Knight. Try not to wet your trousers until the ritual starts. I've just never faced a foe I could not engage with my blade. At last. You must not have faced many foes. <laughs> the Grey Wardens were founded during the First Blight, when humanity stood on the verge of annihilation. So it was that the first Grey Wardens drank of Darkspawn blood and mastered their taint. We're <laughs> going to drink the blood of those... Excuse me? Those creatures. Mastered what now? As the first Grey Wardens did before us, as we did before you. This is the source of our power and our victory. Those who survive the joining become immune to the taint. We can sense it in the Darkspawn and use it to slay the Archdemon. Those who survive? Not all who drink the blood will survive. And those who do are forever changed. This is why the joining is a secret. It is the price we pay. We speak only a few words prior to the joining. But these words have been said since the first. Alistair, if you would. Join us, brothers and sisters. Join us in the shadows where we stand vigilant. Join us as we carry the duty that cannot be forsworn. And should you perish, know that your sacrifice will not be forgotten. And that one day, we shall join you. A whole the joining going on here. I can't believe we got one blood for each person and, and we have to drink it? No way. That was a big cup. It's so, it's like twice as big as his face. Step forward, Jory. But I have a wife, a child. Had I known... There is no turning back. No. You ask too much. There is no glory in this. Why would you I kill him? I don't understand what is those turning back. I guess they have this, they hold the secrets. But the joining is not yet complete. She can't let him leave. You are called upon to submit yourself to the taint for the greater good. From this moment forth, 
You are a Grey Warden. It's a dragon. This it is finished. Welcome. Two more deaths. In my joining, only one of us died, but it was horrible. I'm glad at least one of you made it through. Hey, one out of three, nice. That's something. <laughs> That's something. <laughs> what an amazing ritual. <laughs> Love that. You know, oh, unlucky. A third of you died. If only we had like a migrant, for only half of us died. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> I, I, I don't, I don't quite understand why that other guy had to die. It feels, it feels, feels just rude that you killed him by by slashing him like that. She just told him to leave. Unbelievable. Nothing is prepared for that. Such is what it takes to be a Grey Warden. Did you have dreams? I had terrible dreams after my joining. Such dreams come when you begin to sense the dark spawn, as we all do. That and many other things can be explained in the months to come. Before I forget, there is one last oh part to your God, joining. Oh my so many belts. We take some of that blood and put it in a pendant. Something to remind us of those who didn't make it this far. Take some time. When you're ready, I'd like you to accompany me to a meeting with the king. Very well. The meeting is to the west, down the stairs. Please attend as soon as you're able. We did it! Wow! Did I get the, the staff? Yeah, I did get the staff. Nice. Lovely. Love to remind myself of those who didn't make it this far because they were scared of me killed them. Yeah. <laughs> like yeah, like you don't you don't get you didn't get to do that. If one of them died because you murdered them because you didn't let them leave. <laughs> it's plain rude. Oh my, en Enchanted Dagger looks very tasty. Yum. Better taste like a gingerbread cookie. Look at that. Yum, yum, yum. Oh, ooh, ooh. Level up. Yeah, it's a fresh level up. Nice. I didn't look at these specializations things. Uh, special specialization things. Why not get that? I guess I get that when I have a specialization point. I don't have that. I guess we'll leave that light. Oh, there we go. It tells me right here. 7 and 14. Great. Cool. Uh, Dex. Little bit of cunning. Little bit of Dex. Cool. Oh, okay. So to get more steely, I need 18 cunning. Also level 8 though, so I don't need to rush that one. Anyway. Uh... Oh no, I already got the um, the thing last time. The combat training thing. Yeah, so I can actually get more of these things now. And I chose to get the passive one because I'm very boring. I'm, I'm the most boring guy. <laughs> These items while sneaking... Oh, sneaking during combat. Oh, that's nice. Okay, so I should get 18 cunning for sure then. Before level 8. What level am I right now? Can I tell it anywhere? 5. Uh, where am I? Okay, so 18 cunning. Um, um, I'll be fine before level 8. We're good. Combat movement? Oh. Coup de gras. 
think coup de gras is really good. I should definitely get that as well before eight. So I might want to get combat movement. Oh, I got 2,000 points. Nice. Sorry. I might want to get that before eight. So I can get that. And with the other point. Maybe I'll get. Jewel up is weak or jewel striking. Oh, that's like a mode. I see. More damage, but I cannot do crits or backstabs. Uh, is that good? I don't know if that's good. Is it good? I'm just gonna take. Um... Maybe I should take a uh, lift pallet. Normal damage, but getting a bonus to armor penetration. I'm taking the stealth. That's what I'm doing. If we can get to this one at some point. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. No. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> cool. Let's uh, drop a save here. Uh, dub this on stream. Two. So if we can take a little break, we have to do our mark now. Thank you for reminding me. Uh, and I'll be right back in a couple minutes. Five-ish minutes-ish. Ish, something like that. Yeah, hope you enjoy the stream. See you all soon. Be right back. Let's see, where's the break? Here's the break. Be right back, everyone. See you soon.
Hello! Hey everyone, hello! Welcome back everyone, at least welcome back me, I'm back, hello! <laughs> Hope you all got yourself a little stretch, maybe a little thing of water, if you didn't, uh, posture check. I have no one okay. slatching on my stream. Better not be slatching at all. You risk too much, Kaelin. A darkspawn horde is too dangerous for you to be playing hero on the front lines. If that's the case, perhaps we should wait for the Orlesian forces to join us after all. I must repeat my protest to your fool notion that we need the Orlesians to defend ourselves. It is not a fool notion. Our arguments with the Orlesians are a thing of the past, and you will remember who is king. How fortunate Marek did not live to see his son ready to hand Ferelden over to those who enslaved us for a century. Then our current forces will have to suffice, won't they? Duncan, are your men ready for battle? They are, your majesty. And this is the recruit I met earlier on the road? I understand congratulations are in order. Oh, that other guy that can't be a villain, he can't be evil. No, he, he just looks evil coded, don't worry about it. And he's mean and he's rude, don't worry about it, he's fine. Black armor, big bags on his legs, no, he's, he's fine. <laughs> he's just sleepy, don't worry about it. <laughs> oh, hey, Ecolic, hello, I forgot to say, welcome. Nice to see you, welcome, welcome. Yeah, he just looks sleepy and unwashed, don't worry about it. <laughs> Um, I didn't have uh, a choice, really. I didn't ask for this. I suppose none of us do. But every Grey Warden is needed. Your fascination with glory and legends will be your undoing, Kaelin. We must attend to reality. Fine. Speak your strategy. The Grey Wardens and I draw the Darkspawn into charging our lines, and then... You will alert the tower to light the beacon, signalling my men to charge from To flank cover. the Darkspawn, I remember. This is the Tower of Ishal in the ruins, yes? Well, who shall light this beacon? Mm. I have a few men stationed there. It's not a dangerous task, but it is vital. Then we should send our best. Send Alistair and the new Grey Warden to make sure it's done. That's your best? What are you talking about? I just got conscripted. Yesterday. <laughs> What? Excuse me. <laughs> That's such a whiplash that he after he says, let's send our best. <laughs> you won't, even I won't be fighting in a battle? We need the beacon. Without it, Logain's men won't know when to charge. You see? Glory for everyone. You rely on these Grey Wardens too much. Is that truly wise? Enough of your conspiracy theories, Logain. Grey Wardens battle the Blight no matter where they're from. Your Majesty, you should consider the possibility of the Arch Demon appearing. There have been no signs of any dragons in the wilds. Isn't that what your men are here for, Duncan? I... yes, Your Majesty. Your Majesty, the tower and its beacon are unnecessary. The we Circle of Magi... Whoa, his hands. His arms are so long. Save them for the Darkspawn. Enough! It's like an orangutan. Suffice. The Grey Wardens will light the beacon. Thank you, Logain. I cannot wait for that glorious moment. The Grey Wardens battle beside the King of Ferelden to stem the tide of evil. A little bit too close. Yes, Kaelin. A glorious moment for us all. That guy also wants in on the close action. <laughs> he has any of very best, the new guy and his friend. You and Alice Two of them. Go to the Tower of Ishal and ensure the beacon is lit. What? I won't be in the battle. We went over this. This is by the king's personal request, Alistair. If the beacon is not lit, Terran Logain's men won't know when to charge. It's gonna be lit. So he right. needs two Grey Wardens standing up there holding the torch just in case, right? Stop your whining. We have an important job. We must do whatever it takes to destroy the Darkspawn. Exciting or no. I get it, I get it. Just so you know, if the king ever asks me to put on a dress and dance the Remigold, I'm drawing the line. Darkspawn or no. That's how you know Alistair is not a cool dude. Way to take a stand, Alistair. I have my dignity. Well, some. Mm. The tower is on the other side of the gorge from the king's camp, the way we came when we arrived. You'll need to cross the gorge and head through the gate and up to the tower entrance. From the top, you'll overlook the entire valley. 
<laughs> those wood green haircuts, man. Okay. It does look like someone carved the hair into a block of wood. <laughs> you could put a bunch of pigment on the hair and make a nice ancient painting. <laughs> Sounds easy enough. We will signal you when the time is right. Alistair will know what to look for. I know what I have to do. Then I must join the others. From here, you two are on your own. Remember, you are both Grey Wardens. I expect you to be worthy of that title. Duncan. May the Maker watch over you. May he watch over us all. Good luck, Dunk. Alistair disapproves? Oh shit, you have to- Ah, oh, that- We're playing one of those games where you have to like suck up to everyone. I'm not- I'm not a fan when I have to like be a sycophant in order to get along with my party. <laughs> like, it, it just colors the way you- you play the game, right? I- I-, well, I I guess I'm just role playing as the kind of guy where I don't get along with Alistair. I have the DLC. Yeah, I do. Uh, right? Just uh, give him a bit of gifts. Yeah, I do have that. And it's something I have to take into account because um, I remember playing with the DLC at some point. Like, very briefly. I didn't get far. And I got really put off by the gifts that they give you. It's like absurd. Because uh, they give you enough gifts to just like max out your affinity with a person as soon as you get them. It's so strange. It's another one of those things where, like, if you have, like, certain bonuses, like, pre-order bonuses, DLCs, they just, like, ruin the game a little bit for you. It's bizarre. Uh, so I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to exert some, some restraint there and just not fuck that up. <laughs> fuck the story up for the sake of the stream and my experience. Wait, everyone's gone. Hang on. How does this level up? He's a Templar already. How do you do that? How many spec points are you going to get to analysis, though? Because he's five. Is he just going to skip the point at seven? What, what points are good for warriors? Do you just, like, get a ton of strength? What does he need for his stuff? Probably gonna need con for some stuff, right? Like shield slam and stuff? No! Dex? Strength and dex. And uh, his Templar stuff just needs levels, I guess. Oh, have you, have you? Just strength! Huh. Well, interesting. Uh, I should probably get shield defense on him. That's a stance, right? Yep. Doesn't he have another stance? No, he has access to it, but he doesn't have it. Cool, cool. Oh, um, just give him some strength, I guess. And, uh, yeah. now that done that, so I'd like to go into his tactics, and... Ugh. Oh, hang on, what does shield cover? Is that another stance? Well, you can sustain multiple things, though, can't you? Ah, oh, frig. Oh, so why did I get that done? Uh, what's the difference? Ah, oh, frig. Whoops. Missile attacks. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, good. So, uh, it's good to have both of them. I should sort my bars a little bit here to make things a bit more convenient for me. Cool. Strength dex. On this trash. Into the garbage with it. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> fair enough. Uh, it's also Dave was playing through this recently. He had basically all the DLC shit disabled. 
It's not the way to go. Um, yeah. Yeah, I, um, I think I'll have it. I think, um, but I'm gonna have to do some restraint. I, I think it's too late for me to maybe to, to customize uh, the DLC stuff. I'm not sure. Where am I going, by the way? Ah, I see. I've been just running circles, just kind of confused where to go for a while, though. Yeah, I don't know if you can do it now, but well, just don't do stuff if it seems too good, or do who cares. Yeah. I, I, I feel like I'm not gonna use the stuff if it seems too good. Like... It, like, right now, it's a bit silly that I can, like, level up strength a bunch of times and just wear the, um, the blood dragon plate right now. I don't know, man. It just... It fucks up the curve a little bit, you know? It's just... You gotta have some... Uh, what's the word? Delayed gratification, you know? <laughs> we gotta... We gotta edge our party a little bit. Hopefully there's a stash somewhere where I can put all this the garbage. Because <laughs> I don't want to sell it either. The blight ends here. But I, I think it would be nice to work, like use it in the end or something. Maybe, you know? It can be an option then. Get out of the cursor. If you do the stance, it's a tradition to shout, This is the stance. When you actually do it, I'll do that exactly once. <laughs> oh, Ogrefella. I remember this, guys. Like a waste of dogs. For Ferelden! Right? That's just the wrong order, right? Like, why wouldn't you, like, have the dogs flank them or something? Just <laughs> anything but just a weird, pointless meat shield. <laughs> Especially considering that those um, mulberry hands are actually like, stronger than people are. <laughs> oh my god, these this guys are having an unpleasant time. Better get out of here. <laughs> Freaking death screamer alley over here. So loud. Let me out of here. I gotta light the torch, it's very important. I got the big boy birthday job. Help me, they're everywhere. You, you're Grey Wardens, aren't you? The tower, it's been taken. What are you talking about, man? Taken how? The Darkspawn came up through the lower chambers, they're everywhere. Most of our men are dead. Then we have to get to the beacon and light it ourselves. Oh no, we have to do something. If we could just have Lord of Rings this game is sometimes. Yeah. Yeah, like, there's many points in the game where you're just like, oh, hang on. <laughs> so you've also seen Lord of the Rings, eh? 
I guess I don't mind. <laughs> I like Lord of the Rings. But it is, it is quite funny when you see, like, I mean, these, like, orc designs are just very, like, reminiscent of the of the movies. Uh, let me use the lesser ones instead of the big ones. And just moments like that, like we just had. Just the way things are, like, framed, like the set pieces, just remind me a lot of uh, the movie. <laughs> What sort of spells do you have, buddy? Lightning, sure. Cane shield. Paralyze. Flaming weapons. Oh, hang on. That's a good one. Absolutely, I'll use that. Uh, lightning is pretty good too, isn't it? I think you can do something like this. Uh, zap. It, it's fine, it's fine. What is paralyze? Bit weaker, sure. Makes sense. Ooh, flame blast. That's like the fireball, right? That's the one you have to be careful with, I think. This is orgasm music, yeah, like it also just sounds like the movies too, yeah. <laughs> In many ways it just sounds so uh, much like the uh, Lord of the Rings trilogy. I guess it's hard to make a um, original, like, uh, fantasy IP and not be very derivative of uh, Lord of the Rings. <laughs> we need to get to the beacon. The king needs low gain to In this case, it was probably quite deliberate, though, I, I imagine. The okay. king. Did uh, Bio was very. Um, uh, involved with EA at this point, right? This was an EA published game, I think, right? I don't know if they've always been with EA, but I feel like uh, at this point they were at the this is it. Uh, I can just imagine like um, the the higher ups at the um, EA just coming into the studios and being like, "You didn't make this like more like Lord of the Rings somehow." <laughs> Please and thank you. Oh, it's a flame for a cone thing. I see. There's a lot of stuff in this that has like friendly fire, uh, isn't there? So I should be quite careful, I think. What is uh, Arcane Shield? Minus defense. Sure, makes sense. Die. This was the first game released of the EA, I think. Oh, okay, I see. That's interesting. What was the game that uh, released um, before now, then? I don't actually quite remember what uh, Bioware did. Bioware didn't do um, Knights of the Old Republic, did they? Maybe they did one of them and then Obsidian did a sequel. Something like that. I think they did Jade Empire at, like, after getting involved with EA, right? Beginning of the end, yeah. Yeah. But there were some good games at the start, though, right? Like, Dragon Age Origins is great. What about Mass Effect? Mass Effect, um... I think that was uh, published by EA. Some good stuff. Oh, did you make, uh, did make Baldur's Gate once? Okay. Oh, it's Black Isles uh, Interactive, or whatever the name is. Is that uh, Bioware then? So I, I thought that's who made uh, like Baldur's Gate. Something like that. I, I forget the names. It, it's a long time ago. I wish I had Fireball with this guy. Fireball would be great. Oh, I've been... I've been gunked. Oh, frick. Hang on. What if you just... Leave. Maybe we just leave. Uh, do a little sippy as well. So it's nice that we all share inventories. Not that the manager who has the health potions or anything. I can't do it in combat? Ah, oh, frig. We'll just sit here and uh, wait for him to come here. Like this. Rude orcs hiding behind barricades on fire. 
setting your your feet on fire and trying to engage them. Well, just leave. Just get out of here. Skidaddle, skidoodle. I'm leaving the neutral. Alright, no more traps now, though, right? There's a wizard over there it's shooting snot at me. Oh, there's a fair few guys here. Ugh. I'm gonna have to potion up again, aren't I? Good thing I have eight of them. At your order. You're just a, a random ass guy with no name. Literally. Tower guard. You get a regular small health potion. Hang on, where's my wizard? There he is. Hang on, the um arcane shield, is that Yeah, it only affects uh mage. That's the bad. Can I do a kern here? Like, yeah, I can. If I do a very <coughs> mobile mage. <laughs> mobile, mobile mage on it. Alright, now do a zap and just leave. Nope! Someone died, Alistair died. That's fine. He'll get an injury from it, but I don't think that's the worst thing in the world, is it? What now? Uh, oh, I need to visit the camp for it, that's it. Or I use an injury kit? I don't think I have that. I can make it. I did see a recipe for it, but I don't have it. That's fine. I can tell this guy is a tank player, LOS pulling like that. <laughs> yep. It's uh, it's necessary though. Like some of the encounters so far have been like, well, if you don't do it, you die. <laughs> like the bridge before, man. Oof. Black Isle became obsidian. Uh, that's how it works. Yeah. Okay. Gotcha. A massive hit is massive is Microsoft. Huh. I forgot that. Limit Knights, Jade Empire, Mass Effect, yeah. I did not ever play um, Jade Empire. Has anyone played that? I mean, I hear often quite mixed things about the Jade Empire. Well, I guess uh, oh, it makes sense that the Mass Effect was uh, Microsoft published, doesn't it? Because wasn't that a um, Eggbox exclusive? I think that was just in the 360. I think that's why that's one of those reasons why it took so long for me to play Mass Effect. Or was it on PC as well? Couldn't forget. Cut them down. I wish the character um, you have selected would also have um, like AI. Is there a way to toggle that? Most of the time right now, I don't have to make any actions, I can just I can just watch the fights. And then I realize that like, oh, I'm just watching the fights and my one of my characters is doing literally nothing right now. <laughs> it was from PC. It eventually made it on PS3 as well. Okay, okay. Huh. Yeah, I feel like it was on Xbox um, right. first though. Or uh, for consoles at least. Because I, I, I feel like... Um, a friend had it, but I, I didn't have a way of playing it. Yummy, elf root. Yum, yum, yum. Silver bracelet. I don't think this are uh, any good at all. I don't think they're doing anything. Injury kit. Um, I could use that right now, but I think this is easy enough that I don't need to. Good going. Alright, fine. Let's not be greedy. Let's just use it. It was a pretty demanding game, I think. I remember it running like pure shit on my laptop. Uh, yeah, I um, I imagine so. It looks pretty good, right? Yeah, in the corner. There we go. <laughs> Alistair, what are you doing, coward? N a mage, get back! <laughs> silly, silly boys. Yeah. That's the other guys. There's more of you. I know there's more of you. I was setting up for a big old flamethrower that just, just never showed up. We need 
need to get to the beacon. The king needs Loghain to charge. There you are. Come on. Let's get back here. Off I go. You need help? Yes. As you wish. Uh, I'm off. It's a beat. Oh, hang on. I hear Oh no, I, I thought I turned off the AI, but no, they just decided to stand still like that. Weird. <laughs> I had to talk with the AI a bunch of times, I guess I was like, why are you standing still like that? <laughs> you reckon I can play this without ever pausing? I'm gonna give it a try. I'm gonna put my micro to the test here. I'm gonna play this like an RTS. Right. This is how the game is, games will be played from now on. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Make his breath. What are these darkspawn doing ahead of the rest of the horde? There wasn't supposed to be any resistance here. You could try telling them they're in the wrong place. Right, because clearly this is all just a misunderstanding. We'll laugh about this later. At any rate, we need to hurry. We need to get up to the top of the tower and light the signal fire in time. Tyrone Loghain will be waiting for the signal. I didn't really fall in love with the ME until the second game, to be honest. I quite like the first one, but the second one is excellent. It's so good. Yeah, the Mass Effect 2 is like legitimately one of the greatest levels, right? One of the greatest games ever. It's so good. It is so sad, like, how Mass Effect 2 is so good. Um... Now they're not allowed to make any good games anymore. <laughs> Partly because like all the guys that made Mass Effect 2 good don't even work there anymore, right? I mean, it's been so long ago that probably a lot of people there that don't even make video games anymore, who knows? Axe is tier 3, eh? Oh, hang on. His sword is pretty nice though. Yeah, it's so nice, what the hell? Yeah, why would I ever... Why would I ever change the sword? Oh, this is the one I stole! Stole. I, I tricked someone to giving it to me. That's what's stealing. <clears throat> I mean, he gave it to me. <clears throat> so, I, I don't I don't think that's, that's stealing. Even 3 is really good, to be honest. It is. Mass Effect 3 is a really fun game. It's been a while since I played it now, but um, I, I remember... Everyone um, belly aching a storm of, about uh, Mass Effect 3. And um, I went into it kind of, you know, expecting to hate it and gonna make fun of it, you know, because I do that. Whenever I hear there's a funny game out there, I just play it for memes. Um, oh my god, that's, that's a lot. I'm off. Uh, and I played it and I was like, wait a second, this is, this is fine. This is alright. <laughs> this is actually really fun. Even even the ending of the of the game, when you compare it to contemporary games at the time, is fine. Like, really, has there ever been like a lot of games, um, you know, like big RPG games like that that have had like very satisfying endings in the end? Not really. Like to me, with Mass Effect Three, it mo. I feel like it mostly boiled down to um, people were ha uh, unhappy that the endings weren't, like, happier, right? That was my impression, anyway. The previous two endings were pretty satisfying, and three fumbled it. I'm, yeah, 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 like, um, the endings of um, one or two were great, yeah. Um, but like, 1 and 2 didn't like wrap up the story, right? So, I, it's not quite the same. So I, I think, the, the, like, if you did a sort of like Mass Effect 1 or 2 style ending for Mass Effect 3, people would also be mad because like, it wasn't satisfying because it was the end of the trilogy and it ended on an open note, right? It was, they wanted something like as conclusive and, uh, you know, to have as much closure as possible. And I guess they didn't get that.
Uh, yeah, I, I, I thought I thought the ending of the Mass Effect 3 was, was pretty nonsense, I think, at the time. But um, I didn't think much of it. Because I, I felt it, it was just about as bad as a lot of video game stories. <laughs> I, just, I, I guess if you don't think very much of video game stories in the first place, you get, don't get disappointed as much. I'm only ever impre like impressed by video game, video game stories, because I expect so little. I'm I'm never disappointed. <laughs> yeah, I got the stuff. It's nice, nice. Recouping some of the money I spent. Oh, hang on. Yeah, I can make some poisons. Nice, nice. So, nature damage. I stun the target. Penalty to movement speed. So I guess this, the venom is a crap one. Not really. No. So, now I got the poison. How do you use this one? Different extract. Hallucinations. Isn't that what I just made? Hang on. Yeah, it is. I guess those hallucinations are the, the stunts. So I can use that now, I guess. I guess I didn't need to make it because I already had, or already had three of them. There you go. Nice. Build us a conclusion to the series and then nail it. Exactly, yeah. That's the problem. <clears throat> oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Hello. Hey. Is there some guys in there? Right. No, come back. No rush, need to go in. No need to go in there. There we go. Oh, these walls. <laughs> Can't see anything. Yes. I don't know if I like it looking at the uh, at the game like this when I have this option. I'm, I'm 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 like a close-up camera kind of guy. Like yeah, if I have the option to. I think I'll, I'll like All right. in WoW even. I, I prefer playing zoomed in. Going. Whenever I, <laughs> people uh, watch me play sometimes, they always make fun of me. Like, wow, your camera's really off, off close. <laughs> <Yeah>. <clears throat> but I don't know. I, I just I, I just like that. It's nice. I just like looking at my character, looking cool. I just like seeing the cool animations and stuff. My cool armor. The king is depending on us. Oh, the poison wore off fast. It's already off. Okay, so definitely just put it on while fighting in like a critical moment. Huh. Cool. Good to know. Uh, do I have like a button to? Target my whole party. Not really. Point me. Point me. Luton. Hello. Hello. Like me. Whoa, 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 mage, get back. Saving the day. Let's go. Uh, oh, please. Did, did you have to run in there? Why are you even running in there? Alistair, what? Are, oh, Tower God, what are you doing? Get get out of here. Get. Wait. I'm trying to do cool stuff. Oops, sorry. That's the wrong button. I need to move this over here. And this as well. Oh, wow, that did a lot of damage. I guess he's a squishy little baby mage. So 
<laughs> no, that was, that's the despicable stun. That's horrible. Whew, it didn't capitalize on it at all, though. That's nice. Good stuff. Oh my god. Alistair's <laughs> getting at it. Never mind, I don't even have to babysit him. He's just, just killing them. Good stuff. Prefer the console style as well? Yeah, it's nice. It's nice. I don't know, I just feel like uh, I'm more like attached to my character. It just isn't like as important in a game like this, I suppose, because I'm controlling four characters at once, but it's, it's, I don't know, it's nice. Whoa, 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 you just let that guy run right in. Come on, what are you guys doing? Slackers. Oh, I can't do that. As much as I wanna, I just I'm seeing a target for this guy. Really wanted to call my whole team there, though. I would be fine with a zoomed in camera if they stopped making bosses and their attacks were so massive. Yeah, that's the thing, isn't it? Like, um, you just have to, like, um, you have to zoom out, like, at certain moments. Um, in my eyes, so, you, 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 they force you, like, with the design to, to zoom out as much as they want you to zoom in. Because it's, it's not just, like, um, huge bosses either. It's also the, um, the abilities to do. Like, it's, it's quite hard to know where to, like, run when um, they put, like, massive circles everywhere and you zoomed in. You have to zoom that to, like, get a bird's eye perspective on where it's safe, you know? Doggos, can I, can I unleash doggos? Oh, uh, here we go. Oh, that, that, this would have made the fight easier. What is this pathing? I'm playing Dota 2 right now. Stop. Oh, it's too late to know about that. I gotta press tab more to see what's interactable. Ooh, Mabari War Paint. Nice. Cool. Oof, oof. Oh, I, I can lead people into this room, I guess. What if you guys go over here? Uh, I guess. Uh, Alistair. No, oh, no, Alistair will stay behind. It's still right here. You stay like right here. And I'll get you. Come with me. Hello, everybody. Come with me. <laughs> I got Trevor to show you. Show you. There we go. Now we, now we got some dog utility here. Ah, right, you can move now. Oh my god. I wanted it so bad. <laughs> I wanted it so bad. It's a good thing I don't have fireball. It would be too much power for me. Most situations I prefer to pilot someone to conventional movement over a point of click. Yeah. I think I do too. Oh, hello. Someone's mad at me. Ah, we got the dogs in the case though. What are those dogs? Did they go back sleeping? Or did it die? What? What happened? Oh, help him. Come on. What are you guys doing? Get him. Gotta help the doggos. Oh my god, did, these doggos don't need help, man. Jeez. Dude, my body hands are so, so good. Yeah, Dragonfoot is tomorrow. Yeah. Yeah. I didn't realize. Uh, today I wasn't quite sure if I was was off the streaming. I was like, I'm a bit too, oh I'm a bit sleepy. I'm a bit, not sleepy, but I'm a bit tired, oh haggard. Maybe I just wanna watch AGDQ vods uh, for the rest of the night. And uh, I don't know. 
play some Peggle. Um, I figured I'd do it. Uh, uh, anyway, I was I don't know, be like, maybe I'll stream tomorrow. And then I realized, wait a second, I can't do that. I can't stream tomorrow. Dragon fights tomorrow. I gotta play now. Huh. That's gonna be cool, man. It's gonna be cool. We, we've uh, we've been playing Shadowlands for too long. Uh, <laughs> can't wait for. Can't wait for Dragonflight to become Shadowlands. No, no, no. It's gonna be good. Dragonflight, this time wow, it's gonna be good, okay? We've had a couple duds now. Shadowlands... Shadow... Shadow... Uh, Shadowlands? Shadowlands. Didn't quite go according to plans. There we go. BFA? Wasn't quite redemption after... Um, uh... Wait, what was before BFA? I'm no, before BFA we had Legion, right? B uh, Legion was actually good. No, never mind. Yeah. No, oh, Shadowlands, that's what I'm saying. It isn't quite the redemption after BFA. I'm that's what I meant. And um, BFA wasn't quite the follow-up for Legion that we wanted. Right. But maybe this time we'll get a good expansion on hands, you know? Maybe this is gonna be le uh, the Legion to the Warlords that we had before, you know? <laughs> Take that! Honestly though, I'm gonna keep this on the down low. But I'm pretty sure I enjoyed BFA way more than Shadowlands. I'm almost like missing BFA. <laughs> BFA had like good dungeons at least. I cannot stomach doing another keystone in Shadowlands, dude. I can't handle it. My body cannot handle more friggin' Shadowlands dungeons. Please. Do not make me do another Shadowlands dungeon. Please. <laughs> I will be so sad and upset. Uh, but BFA? I feel like we got some, had some good dungeons at the very least. There's some good raids. Battle for Desire Love's good. I think I get to combat tactics here. Do I even need master combat training? Small bonuses to armor and attack. Okay, so it isn't too bad. Um, you get some bonuses uh, as well as the, um, the high T um, things. Fine, let's just get that done. Let's just get that. And then we'll get the shield bolts. Ooh, no longer suffers an attack penalty while using shield defense. Well, well, well. I like that. That's good. Yeah, the problem with the Sonic cycle is that it didn't quite work out for WoW. It didn't quite work out because if it did work out, Shadowlands was supposed to be amazing, but it wasn't quite. Oh, I've been hit by something. I've been hit by a level up. Never mind. That level up looked sinister. I started like glowing red and stuff. I thought I, I thought I was about to die. Get a cannon. There's a dex. Cool. All right, what do we get now? Stealing is good. Come on, turn is good. Tactics is good. Oh, on this character, I just kind of need everything. I just kind of need tons and tons and tons of levels. Um, so I'm doing coercion as well. Maybe going coercion with this character was a mistake because I need everything else already. I just can't afford to have more coercion when I, I need combat training and uh, stealing and tactics. <laughs> I, I went super greedy, thinking I would go coercion here, I feel. I don't need a uh, combat tactics yet, though, do I? Yeah. Oh shit, that would've been good, actually. Bonuses to attack and defense. Can I... Yeah, I can, I can. No, let's go combat tactics. So I can get a dual weapon finesse. And I can later get these other things as well. I think tier 2 makes sense to have, and I, then I can leave it for a little while. Cool. The Sonic Cycle is especially funny because Sonic capped out at mid like 20-30 years ago. Yeah. 
I think could be that it's gonna be good and never and it never is is exactly the same cycle, basically. I think I think there's some maybe good uh, modern Sonics out there, but I'm not, I'm, I'm not sure. I, I think Generations is okay, but when I played it, I definitely felt like it wasn't as good as people were saying. <laughs> I never played Colors. Um, did anyone play um, that um, Werewolf game, Unleashed? People were making fun of that game for, like, you know, the concept of it. Oh my god, Sonic is God of War. But was it actually bad, or was it like, um... Just making fun of it sort of situation for, for the sake of it. Unleashed is every other 3D Sonic. Yeah, fair enough. <laughs> I know exactly what you mean by Sonic. The last Sonic game I played was 06. Good play, 06. Yeah, those six and those six, amazing. <laughs> I remember hearing about how terrible 06 was uh, when that came out, but um, I was like, it's Sonic, it can't be that bad, it's Sonic. <laughs> I, I, I had no idea, I didn't know. I lacked critical information. More dark, eh? Oh, I maybe should save stuns here when he grabs that card. Right. Owie. Oh, that really hurts. Uh, can I? Do I have anything to, like, stun? Is that just a rogue? Oh my god. Yeah, he really, like, um, 100 to 0 so you, <laughs> if he grabs you, huh? It's rough. No, 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 back off, back off. You're not getting your hands on my, my little fella. Oh, nice massive attack, dude. It'd be a shame if it actually hit me. I think your attack needs to be bigger. It's not even close to as big as the jungle. Oh, fuck, never mind. <laughs> never mind. Jungle tier attack. Confirmed. Uh, I have no mana. Yeah. Oh, that's fine. Shit. No. I'm just zoom in. I just want to do this for the rest of the fight. Oh, we're good, we're good. Oh, shit. Did, uh, did I lose up an experience there? Because I died. Oh, please. Send this is the age like milk. It can't be that bad. It's Sonic. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. How wrong I was. How wrong I was, man. Concussion. Penalty to magic. I'm fine. And I'm off. Every chair mill. Hmm. Is that actually an upgrade file, is that? It's got a set bonus, though. Oh my god, it's... Oh, you, you get so much fatigue from it, but... It is quite big armor. I feel like if um, if you are a tier above like that, then uh, I, feel, I feel like there's a good chance it's still worth it. I think we'll light this beacon and then we'll go into a break for the rest of the stream. Probably a few cutscenes is the fad of us. The retreat. But what about the king? Should we not do as I command? Why did it wait for the signal to do it? <laughs> you could have done it at any time. Pull out! All of you, let's move! I guess it's more dramatic this way.
Speaking of Lord of the Rings. Little whispers at dramatic moments. Oh, he was so squishy. Literally. He just was gushing that like a watermelon cake. With Nutella spread on it. Oh no, the king died. Anyway. <laughs> if you like the king so much, you should have sent him into battle. This is what happens when you send your knights out there without the strongest potions. But they are one of the weakest. uncanny but the eyes in this game, right? Can't quite put the finger on it, but they just they just stick out so much. Ah. Oh my I god, I'm ripped. Open. Mother shall be pleased. No one told me this. This is new information. I remember you, from the mountains, the girl from the wilds. I am Morrigan, lest you have forgotten, and we are in the wilds where I am bandaging your wounds. You are welcome, by the way. How does your memory fare? Do you remember Mother's rescue? She rescued me. You mean from the tower? Mother managed to save you and your friend, though t'was a close call. What is important is that you both live. The man who was to respond to your signal quit the field. The Darkspawn won your battle. Those he abandoned were massacred. Your friend, he is not taking it well. I need to get out of here. As you like. Mother is outside with your friend. She wished to see you when you awoke. Why does your mother want to see me? I do not know. She rarely tells me her plans. Were my injuries severe? Yes, but I expect you shall be fine. The Darkspawn did nothing mother could not heal. Uh, thank you for helping me, Morrigan. I... you were welcome. Though mother did most of the work, I am no healer. Ah, uh, we'll go then. I will stay. And make something to eat. You do that. <laughs> Said like a very normal person. <laughs> Ooh, a uh, shield. Oh no, what is this? Why is my inventory full of garbage? How did this happen? Oh. Those guys died, didn't they? So they just put all their crap in my inventory. Bastards. Oh, um, what if I equip stuff? Does it count as weighing me down? Um, uh, where's my arrows? I don't know. Arrows. 79. Not carrying it, any carrying it anymore if I'm wearing it. He required. Oh. I never got to open a chest in the camp. Oh. Got it. The only thing that can comfort me now is spoils from Morgan. Going. Oh, how are these guys so powerful? <laughs> I will never be able to steal from them. Right, I'm gonna have to manage my inventory later. For now, it's break time. Be right back. Hope you enjoyed the stream. See you soon. Here we go.
Hello, I'm back. Welcome back, everyone. I got my cup of coffee. It messed up my hair, apparently. Oh, get out of here. Get out. There you go. Ready to go. See you, Morgan. Oh, did I loot all the stuff? I think I did. Show sure, up, I did. It was just a crap shield or nothing, right? See, here is your fellow Grey Warden. You worry too much, young man. You... you're alive. <laughs> I thought you were dead for sure. Is that a tiny cup or even bigger than I remember? Both. <laughs> I'm huge. But it's also a tiny cup. Well, it's like, um... It's like, um... I don't know. As, as it, it in context of my Xbox controller. It's not a tiny cup. I'm just huge. It's like the perfect size for a cup of coffee, is all. The perfect size. I'm not thanks to Morgan's mother. Oh, this doesn't seem real. Yeah, 15 feet tall. We'd be dead oh yeah, you almost forgot. I have a massive club of lava. If I am not present, lad. I, I didn't mean... But, but what do we call you? You've, ne you've never told us your name? Names are pretty, but useless. The chastened folk call me Flemeth. I suppose it will do. The Flemeth? From the legends? Daveth was right. You're the Witch of the Wilds, aren't you? Then what does that mean? I know a bit of magic, and it has served you both well, has it not? Is this just using big cups, I guess? Maybe. Yeah, I do have bigger cups than this, but um, with those ones, I usually have to uh, fill them up to like the half of them because they're so big. <laughs> but this one, I just fill it to the top, which is dangerous because it's just the right amount of coffee for me. But I also spill all the time, so I gotta have some paper handy. <laughs> So why did you save us? Well, we cannot have all the Grey Wardens dying at once, can we? Someone has to deal with these dark spawn. It has always been the Grey Warden's duty to unite the lands against the Blight. Or did that change when I wasn't looking? The Grey Wardens are no more. Let someone else do it. Of course. Someone else will realize what needs to be done and act in time and with sufficient sense to solve the problem. No need for you. But we were fighting the Dark Spawn. The King had nearly defeated them. Why would Loghain do this? Now that is a good question. Men's hearts hold shadows darker than any tainted creature. Perhaps he believes the Blight is an army he can outmaneuver. Perhaps he does not see that the evil behind it is the true threat. The Archdemon. What is this Archdemon exactly? It is said that long ago, the Maker sent the old gods of the ancient Tevinter Imperium to slumber in prisons deep beneath the surface. An Archdemon is an old god awakened and tainted by Darkspawn. Believe that or not, history says it's a fearsome and immortal thing, and only fools ignore history. He was just about to defeat them when he got squeezed like a toothpaste tube. He, he was, he was the squeeze, wasn't he? And like, <laughs> just a gratuitous amount of blood everywhere. <laughs> like, there's just so much like blood and like people being squished and there just being like blood and giblets going everywhere in this. <laughs> it's, it's such an odd graphic game. Will you help us fight this blight for enough? Me? I am just an old woman who lives in the wilds. I know nothing of blights and dark spawn. Well, whatever Loghain's insanity, he obviously thinks the dark spawn are a minor threat. We must warn everyone this isn't the case. And who will believe you? Unless you think to convince this Loghain of his mistake. He just betrayed his own king. If Al Eamon knew what he did at Ostagar, he would be the first to call for his execution. I don't know. That sounds like a low gain proposition. <laughs> Al Eamon, the Al of Redcliffe? I suppose. Al Eamon wasn't at Ostagar. He still has all his men. 
And he was Kalen's uncle. I know him. He's a good man, respected in the landsmen. Good unk. Of course, we could go to Redcliffe and appeal to him for help. Ah, <laughs> oh, frig! I've been, I've been, I've been fast lashed. <laughs> I should hope that wasn't a counter hit. Keep in mind, Logan was also an honorable man. The Isle would never do what Tan Logan did. I know him too well. I still don't know if Arl Eamon's help would be enough. He can't defeat the Darkspawn Horde by himself. Surely there are other allies you could call on. Of course! The treaties! Grey Wardens can demand aid from dwarves, elves, mages, and other places. They're obligated to help us during a blight. I may be old, but dwarves, elves, mages, this Arl Eamon, and who knows what else. This sounds like an army to me. Does? So can we do it this? sounds like a group of lads. Places and build an army. That's how boy bands worth of allies. <laughs> Level 400 counted for the pun. I have full meat on the walls. Yeah, ah. Oh, I'm getting cowed with this hell, aren't I? <laughs> there I go. <laughs> Whoa, let's look ahead, ahead of ourselves. Take one step at a time. But it is not so bad to know where those steps will lead you. Yes. It's always been the Grey Warden's duty to stand against the Blight. And right now, we're the Grey Wardens. So you are set then, ready to be Grey Wardens. I guess I have nothing better to do, I guess. Oh, I'd be happy with just staying alive. Mm, come to think of it, that would be nice. <laughs> well, don't expect me to do everything. There is, however, one more thing I can offer you. The stew is bubbling, mother dear. Shall we have two guests for the eve? Ooh, supper. Or none. The Grey Wardens are leaving shortly, girl. And you will be joining them. Such a shame. What? You heard me, girl. The last time I looked, you had ears. <laughs> that was a powerful snort, yeah. <laughs> that snort was louder than anything she had to say afterwards. Thank you, but if Morgan doesn't want to... Join us. Her magic will be useful. Even better, she knows the wilds and how to get past the horde. Have I no say in this? No. You have been itching to get no. out of the wilds for years. Here is your chance. As for you, wardens, consider this repayment for your lives. If nobody wants this witch woman, I guess I'll take her. Not to look a gift horse in the mouth. That's a rude thing to call her. Won't this add to our problems? Out of the wilds, she's an apostate. Oh my god, you're such a nug. Little nucky nug over here. Perhaps I should have left. And this nucky bunch. Point taken. Mother, this is not how I wanted this. I'm not even ready. You must be ready. Alone, these two must unite for Eldon against the Darkspawn. They need you, Morrigan. Without you, they will surely fail. And all will perish under the blight. Even I. I... understand. And you, Wardens. Do you understand? I give you that which I value above all in this world. I do this because you must succeed. Morrigan? Morrigan has a real Popeyes thing going on. <laughs> oh my god, a four arms. <laughs> Just swole. She won't come to harm with us. Allow me to get my things, if you please. I am at. Got the walk cycle so good as well. I suggest a village north of the wilds as our first destination. It is not far, and you will find much you need there. Or, if you prefer, I shall simply be your silent guide. The choice is yours. Sure. I prefer you speak your mind. <laughs> you will regret saying that. Dear sweet mother, you are so kind to cast me out like this. How fondly I shall remember this moment. Well, I always said, if you want something done, do it yourself. Or hear about it for a decade or two afterwards. I just... Do you really want to take her along because her mother says so? Get over yourself, Alistair. If you worry that I will summon demons and 
transform into an abomination, I assure you I will at least wait until you are not looking. That's reassuring. I feel better already. I think we should just get going. Farewell, mother. Do not forget the stew on the fire. I would hate to return to a burned down hut. <laughs> Tis far more but. likely you will return to see this entire area, along with my hut, swallowed up by the blight. I... All I meant was... Yes, I know. Do try to have fun, dear. I never heard anyone actually say bah before. That's a, that's a first one. Oh, Morgan approves. Plus eight? Wow. And plus four Alistair? Nice. And what spells do you have, Morrigan? What now? I just want to check into spells. Jeez. Uh, snow. In which are overload. Oh, yeah. I guess I'm carrying, like, Morrigan stuff now. Those aren't Morgan's robes. Look at that thumbnail. There's no, that's, that's not the same at all. Uh, you can have some boots there, right? Uh, yes. Plus six defense? What? Oh, defense is different from armor. I see. Okay, gotcha. I was like, what? Oh, hang on. No, wait a second. Doesn't armor just... No, yeah, it's different. Yeah, it's different. I see. Still look good. Not bad. Uh, you can have some gloves. And a hat too. God, you look like such a dog, Dove. Nice. And I have a staff for you too. Darkspawn staff. It's terrible. Never mind. You don't want this. You don't want this trash. Get out of here. Do you have a belt for you, though? How does she not have one belt on her? I don't know. I just, I just, when I think of like. Goth. GF wizards. I always think they've just put a bunch of belts on them, you know, like Lulu in Final Fantasy X. How does she not have a single belt on her? This is absurd. This is this is crazy. There's a belt. It's a, this own category for belts, apparently. She has a necklace on. Oh, only she can wear it. I, I guess I guess that's for mental resistance. You can take this cold resistance, yeah, buddy. There you go. That resistance is pure mental. That skirt is mostly belts, is it? Well, I, I guess. I guess it's. I guess you. Could, it's like belts hanging down. <laughs> I guess. I guess you could put those together and make a, a an actual belt. <laughs> I suppose. I was just thinking of those like as. Leather straps all hanging down, you know, she's like, she's ruined a lot of backpacks to make her skirt look like that. That's what I felt. <laughs> Guess I'm good on equipment now. Oh, hang on, hang on, I could put on a bow. How come I haven't uh, put on a bow already? What's the difference between a bow and a crossbow in this? For some reason, the crossbow does a ton of damage, for some reason. Huh, wait! Oh, there's a strength modifier on the on the longbow. That's a difference. So, like, this, the, the crossbow, is probably no matter what's going to be better for me right now, right? Neil again? Uh... Also, it uses bolts. It's gonna be a big difference. But it looks like, for my use purpose right now, it's just, it's just better in every way to use a crossbow. Like, better range, better armor penetration, better crit. No requirements. <laughs> Weird. I guess it kind of makes some sense. To be incentivized to use a crossbow when you're not skilled. Get a party and went to fort? Yeah, absolutely. I'm just mad that you didn't say the line. Oh, the world map. Nice. I remember. Let's go to Lovering, I guess. No, no, let's go to camp. Yeah, let's go to camp first. Man, speaking of um, Ram Farslash. 
how crazy isn't that? Like that uh, beak driver got put into Strive, and it's probably definitely worse than Ramaful Fast Lash, <laughs> right? <laughs> I haven't seen a hitbox on uh, Beak Driver, but it seems kind of like it could use. I don't know. I feel like Beak Driver should be better. It should be long at least. Big driver getting punished on block like full screen Lamo. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not gonna join the Sin is Bad train, but Big Driver being the way it is feels dubious to me. There's like no one in the camp. I guess they don't join us until we go to Lovering. Fair enough. Do I have any injuries? No. I guess I can just leave them. I feel like I don't want to chat with my party right now. Lovering. Absolute mental like. <laughs> oh! I've been ambushed. I've been waylaid by bandits. This, this isn't bandits. This is just a town. Did a town ambush me? Oh, it's a cutscene. I see. And Events can happen. each of you to supply these men. Why is it loud? We must rebuild what was lost at Ostagar and quickly. There are those who would take advantage of our weakened state if we let them. We must defeat this darkspawn incursion, but we must do so sensibly and without hesitation. Your lordship, if I might speak. You have declared yourself Queen Anora's regent, and claim we must unite under your banner for our own good. But what of the army lost at Ostagar? Your withdrawal was most... fortuitous. Everything I have done has been to secure Ferelden's independence. I have not shirked my duty to the throne, and neither will any of you! The Banorn will not bow to you simply because you demand it. Understand this. I will brook no threat to this nation from you or anyone. Bantigan, please! Your Majesty. Your father risks civil war. If Eamon were here... Bantigan, my father is doing what is best. Did he also do what was best for your husband, Your Majesty? <gasps> what happened to her husband? I'm sure he's just on a very long vacation right now. He's a toothpaste guy. Ah, oh, that's it. That's us. But I see. I didn't. I didn't know who she was. I guess the Majesty thing should have tipped me off. I don't buy this at all. That dog would have handled those guys single-handedly. Single, poorly. Oh yeah, Morgan spells. I've got. Uh, Winter's grasp. Sure, I, I like that zone in, in WoW Rough Dolch King. Uh, it, it was good for farming materials. Uh, sure. It's, it's a cold spell. Grand life. Yep, it does what you imagine. Disorient, it does what you imagine, I guess. Oh, but she has fucking spider form. <laughs> we forgot about that. Horror, oh, horror is good. Mind blast, that's the thing, isn't it? That's super strong. Oh, no, I think Mind... There was... I feel like there was, um... There's some combo you could do with Mind Blast. That was, like, like really horrible. Uh, Frost Weapon... I'm gonna do this while I do while I look at my spells. You can you can have a look as well. So Frost Weapons, that's good. Lightning... Friend of Fire Possible, that's great, nice. A little Sleepy check. Cool, yeah. Vulnerability hex. Okay. Excellent. 
when this grapple is good, good single target nuke. Yeah, it's like, shoom, good, good damage, right? Good, good nuke. Yeah. Oh, fuck. He fucking exploded. <laughs> How fast was that? I fucking any percent of his life, though. Oh, uh, this is all coming back to me now, man. This is not coming back to me. Just playing Morrigan and just like spamming all your spells at the start of a fight. <laughs> just killing everything. God, Morrigan is so fucking strong at the start here. Oh my god, Alistair just friggin' died. He was crit or something. Something really hurt. I feel like spider form is pointless, right? I don't I don't think it's gonna help me. I guess you can do it when you have no mana, right? Oh yeah, there's a cast time on the uh, druid shapes. Bzz, I'm a spider knight. Oh, what? Oh, okay, that's the not become not spider button. My bad, sorry. I'm just kill this guy with uh, Frost Blast. Yeah, Winter's Grasp is amazing. Yeah, between this and Doggo, we got a good thing going here, I think. This game is really good. Been too long since I played it. Yeah, that's that's how I've been feeling about this game for a long time, man. I, I kept thinking, like, just I got quite far into this game like ten years ago, and I just didn't finish it. Um, and I've been thinking about it ever since. Like, I really should just go back and finish it. Like, I, I, pro I still had my save for a very long time. Uh, I just knew that if I went back, I, I've gotten everything, so it was no point to it. I'm, re I'm really happy. Eh? I finally. Got some motivation now to, to play it again because uh, it, it holds up really well. It's still really fun. It's good. Let the dog go. I think he was out there looking for you. He's chosen you. Mabari are like that. They call it imprinting. Does this mean we're going to have this mangy beast following us about now? Wonderful. Rude. He's not mangy. Yeah. At least he likes animals, and that's always a good sign on people. I always wanted a dog like this. Maybe it's meant to be. I don't even need to give him war paint. He's got it already. Enter a name for the dog? Enter a name for the dog. I I, I remember... I think I actually remember what I, what I always used to name my dog. For some reason, I just always name my dog Horatio. <laughs> so I'm gonna stick with it. That's, that, that. There's no need to break a system that... Um, that, all, that works still. New codex, a ratio. <laughs> and I'm off. And yes. F root. Yum yum. Huh. Dog is officially Monty since Spelunky 2. Oh. Well, well, well. A new Daredevil has joined Spelunky 2, apparently. <laughs> Welcome, dog. What has dog got? Ah, I see. Dog has dog, bark, bite. Sure. Okay. All good things. Dread howl. Stunning nearby enemies. Cool. No. Let's see. Let's see. You should see the abilities. Healthy to defense. Hey, not bad. Little charge. I guess the target thing's gonna charge, charge them. Cool. Nice. We'll, we'll get them apart eventually. I need to look at the character sheet for for ratio actually. Bark spawn, that's a good name. <laughs> but no, his real name is actually Horatio. Look at this smug guy about the robbers. More travelers to attend to. <laughs> Led by an elf of all things. Uh they don't look much like their mothers, you know, uh, maybe we should just let these ones pass. Nonsense. Greetings, travelers! Oh my god, it's huge! Playing on those fleeing the darkspawn, I suppose. They are fools to get in our way. I say, teach them a lesson. Now is that any way to greet someone? <laughs> a simple ten silvers and you're free to move on. Ten silvers? Your toll collector's done? 
indeed, for the upkeep of the Imperial Highway. It's a bit of a mess, isn't it? Perhaps you should charge more them. You want to pay more? Well, we'll happily accept donations. I'm just saying it's rough business for such a pittance. I could be mistaken, but that sounded threatening. Sounded like a threat to me. Interesting, because you seem a bit outnumbered. Excuse me, you're one more guy. It's hard to be outnumbered by common thugs. Well, I can't say I'm pleased to hear that. We have rules, you know. Right. We get to ransack your corpse then. Those are the rules. <laughs> I love this guy with his fucking classic thug voice. <laughs> uh, boss, they're not giving us the money, sir. Uh, boss, what we do? <laughs> <laughs> you mean the fun of fight a Grey Warden? Did he say he's a Grey Warden? Them ones killed the king. Traitors to Ferelden, I hear. Turn Logain put quite a bounty on any who are found. But are them Grey Wardens good? I mean, really good. Good enough to kill a king. You have a point. Well, let's forget about the toll. We'll just leave you to your dark spawn fighting, king killing ways. You know, the Grey Wardens could use a donation. You don't say. He is really good, boss. Remember. Well, yes. Twenty silvers? That's all we've collected today. Not enough, I'm afraid. Just when we had things settled. Not enough. Could you add 20 experience on that uh, as well? Thank you. Let's see. The leader first then. Zap. I need to arrange these abilities and the order I will spam them as I as I kill these idiots. Spider over here. Ooh, I got two stuns as well. How, how about stun you? Zap. Eventually. There we go. Uh, and you can get stunned as well, why not? My blast. Oh, it's an AoE one! Oh my god, it's AoE! How is that allowed? We should have that vulnerability extortion now. All right, we surrender. We're, we're just trying to get by before the dog spawn get us all. This short operation is pathetic. I could do better. Um, right. I guess so. I'm sorry. Mm hmm. Hand over everything you've stolen. Yes, yes, of course. The coins we collected are right here. Uh, just over a hundred silvers. Ooh. The rest is in the chest we've that's got. Not, that's not bad at all. I want the questions answered. Well, what could I tell you? We aren't even from these parts. Hmm. What news have you heard? Everyone's saying how the Grey Wardens betrayed the King during the Darkspawn fight. Got him and themselves killed. Turn Logain pulled out just in time. First thing he's doing as Regent is putting a bounty on Grey Warden. This is the perfect time for a pleasant conversation. Uh, have you heard about any survivors from the battle? Couple, maybe. A group of wounded Ash Warriors came Ooh, by earlier. Okay. Got right out of their way. What's going on in Lovering? It's packed full. The band took his men north with Tear and Logain, so there's no one looking out for it except a few Templars at the Chantry. And Lovering is like... To feed my family, you know? Lovering is like the most RPG town name of all time. <laughs> what exactly have you been doing? Well, watching for folks fleeing from the south. Chasing from the wilds and farm holders, mostly. There aren't soldiers here anymore, so we help ourselves. We try not to hurt anyone too much. I'm done asking well, questions. Let me go. You follow my lead. I could use some soldiers. Well, you're joking, right? I could never be a soldier. Then start running. Don't Bless come you. back. The dark spawn can have this place. I'll take those experience points though. Thank you. Ooh, gold fifty. Nice. Hey, that was worth it. 
Who's this? The Templar. I sure hope you don't mind this other stuff. I'm just looting this fellow over here. Knight's Nerd, Knight's Locket. This golden locket bears within it a tiny painting of a pretty brown-haired young woman. It is impossible to tell who the woman might be, but whoever owned the locket was quite fond of her. Hmm. And a note. So we're done. Perhaps the locket will mean something to someone back in Livering. Well, I'll have to look at the codex, I guess. Mm. Redcliffe for Rigby. Oh, this is the guy I summoned at some point. I'm just gonna not read that. And choose to ignore. I guess I got a note from Sir Henrik. Uh, hmm. You always knew this, but I believe I now know where Brother Genitivi lies. I've been to his home in Denerim. I found a trail. I'm amazed that other knights have not been done likewise. I don't know who this Brother Genitivi is. Should anyone find his rumblings, all I ask is that he be informed of my fate. I pray that he completes what I cannot. Okay. Fair enough. I guess I've got a quest for Jenny TV at some point, then. Ooh, hello? Man, like... Is there anyone out there that gets, like... Ambushed by bandits? And like well, presses the option to give money to not to not go into a fight. Who does that? Painting. Ah, so you have Hands up. decided to rejoin us, have you? Falling on your blade in grief seemed like too much trouble, I take it. Is my being upset so hard to understand? Have you never lost someone important to you? Just what would you do if your mother died? Before or after I stopped laughing. Right, very creepy. Forget I asked. I've seen RPs uh, do it in Elder Scrolls sometimes. Yeah, I think that's basically what the option's there for, right? Like, I feel like the, the way I play video games, I would just never press that option, right? But maybe I, I should take a lesson from those guys. Because they seem to have, have, have more fun than me. <laughs> like, RPing as some wealthy mage who doesn't like to fight things, yeah. I do feel like I've never played any of these games and been in, like, a um, mechanical position where, like, I've not been able to fend off bandits, you know? Like, so very rarely they have, like, bandit encounters like this, where they are so threatening that it's better to say nah. I feel like the only game where I've seen something like that happen is, like, maybe Outward. Um, that game was punishing as hell. At some point you get kidnapped by bandits, and... Oh my god, like, that save may as well have just been doomed. <laughs> Like, trying to get my stuff back from the bandits. Um, we were two as well, trying to get our stuff from the bandits when we, we got kidnapped. It was a nightmare, they were horrible. <laughs> That's like the, the closest I ever got to like, feeling threatened by bandits waylaying us. What did you want to talk about, Alistair? His navel, I suspect. He certainly has been contemplating it for long enough. Oh. I get it. This is the part where we're shocked to discover how you've never had a friend your entire life. I can be friendly when I desire to. Alas, desiring to be more intelligent does not make it so. Oh, anyway, no. I thought we should talk about where we suffer, but first. oh no. You have some thoughts on that point, Alistair? This should be good. I think. What Flemeth suggested is the best idea. These treaties, have you looked at them? Uh, yes, I have. There are three main groups that we have treaties for. The Dalish Elves, the Dwarves of Orzammar, and the Circle of Magi. I also still think that Arleman is our best bet for help. We might even want to go to him first. A Dalish Elves, that uh, was one of the potential starting stories, I think, for a character. That's cool. Why are you leaving it up to me? Well, I don't know where we should go. I'll do whatever you decide. 
Now that is unsurprising. Al Eamon is a good man, but I don't know for sure he's where we should go. I'm not going to fight about it. Let's remit to contacting Greymorn. Short of leaving Ferelden to seek them out, the only place to send word to would be Weisalp Fortress. And that's thousands of miles away. Mm, that'd be a long drive. Not sure if any of this is a good idea. I'm not sure I like any of it either, but we don't have a lot of choice in the matter. Of course you have a choice. You could run and forget about it all. Let the Darkspawn do as they wish until other Grey Wardens come. If they come. That's what you call a choice? Yeah. It may not be a good choice, but it's a choice nevertheless. We all choose our path, even when it seems there is only one direction we should go. How enlightening. At any rate, I'll stay with you whatever you decide. I guess that Eamon thing sounds like a good idea. What do you think we should do, Morgan? Go after your enemy directly. Find this man Loghain and kill him. The rest of this business with the treaties can then be done in safety. Yes, he certainly wouldn't see that. That sounds like a good plan, like honestly. The advantage of an army and experience and... I was asked for my opinion and I gave it. If your wish is to come up with reasons why something cannot be done, we will stand here until the Darkspawn are upon us. Then we need to find his people. I can give you directions if you like. Sure. Where would Loghain be? If he isn't out in the field with his army, he's probably going to be at the palace in Denerim. We can go to Denerim, but somehow I suspect that they're not going to let us just walk around. Only a suspicion, of course. I think it probably makes more sense to do the Al Eamon thing first. He'll be at the castle Redcliffe, in the far western part <gasps> of the realm, next that. to the mountain passes. If he isn't there, someone will be able to tell us where he is. I don't need any more directions. Then you have a plan. I'm ready to get going. Fair enough. Let's head into the village whenever you're ready. Excellent. I think it will be fun to do the um, low gain thing first. But I feel like I'm going to hit a brick wall if we do anything like that. <laughs> I'm just going to go for my hints here. There it goes. Black bean enchiladas. That sounds pretty good. That sounds pretty good. Had some black bean uh, tackers at some point recently. It's pretty good too. I'm a, I'm a fan. Huh. Elf fruit, nice. I think I should uh, grab any elf fruit we can. It's pretty good. What else? Healing potions. Although I don't suppose any of us can actually yeah. make any potions. <gasps> oh, Morrigan can. Morrigan can. And a distillation agent for health pulses. But I can make the regular ones. I guess it kind of feels a bit lame to, to waste on my elf root on lesser ones, you know? Mage Tower first, let's get uh, to the Fade ASAP. You are so correct. Yeah, you're correct. Yeah, Mage Tower first, yeah. Uh, yeah. Man, that fade stuff is... Uh, it's like... If you're looking it's such a slog, isn't it? There's none to be found. It's like so long-winded. Oh, it just takes forever. And wail and gnash their teeth. It is sad to watch how helplessly they... Back off. I have the right to charge what I wish. You profit from their misfortune. I should have the Templars give away everything in your carts. You wouldn't dare. Any of you step too close to my goods and I'll... It's so nice to see everyone working together in a crisis. Warms the heart. Oh, you there. You look able. Would you care to make a tiny profit helping a beleaguered businessman? Oh, cool. Rent seeking. Nice. Well, would I want to help you? Didn't I mention profit? He is charging outlandish prices for things people desperately need. Their blood is filling his pockets. Tis only survival of the fittest. All of these Cretans would do the same in his shoes. Oh, Give no. them a chance. Libertarian I Morrigan. Have limited supplies. The people decide what those supplies are worth to them. You bought most of your wares from these very people last week. Now they flee for their lives, and you want to talk business? Look, stranger, I have a hundred silvers if you drive this rabble off, starting with that priest. I'm an honest merchant, nothing more. I don't know. 
I don't I don't like the look of your beard. You don't think you're being unscrupulous. Would it help these folks if they could buy no goods at all? They spend their very last coin because they are desperate. And this man preys upon them as surely as the bandits outside the city. Ah, I'm not arguing anymore. Drive off this woman and get your hundred silvers. Otherwise, I'm taking my wagon and leaving. I think you can compromise and still make a, cro uh, still make a profit, no? Perhaps. If that woman agrees, I'm allowed to charge something. Do what you must. So long as the prices do not beggar the needy. Fine, fine, done. And since you don't look too needy, normal prices for you. So, we have come to solve every squabble in the village personally. Absolutely. Hmm? My, but the Darkspawn will be impressed. Oh, give us the experience points. Generous assistance. May the Maker watch over your... I just remembered something. Yep. You gotta be careful doing... Anything while Morrigan is in your party. She'll hate anything you do. <laughs> She's horrible. Like, I, I frequently just, like, took Morgan out of my party whenever I wanted to talk to any NPCs because she just always disapproves of everything you do. <laughs> it's so annoying. <laughs> hmm. A gift. Nice. And six flasks. That's not bad. Morgan will disapprove anything that isn't being a cunt and completing the main quest. Yep, exactly, yeah. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> bandits everywhere. Uh, bandits, 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 bandits. Okay, cool. I'll accept that. Strange. That's a... That's a... Uh... What's the word? The bounty bullet and just had the word bandit all over it. It's crazy. No the legions of evil are on your doorstep. They will feast upon our hearts. There is nowhere to run. This evil will cover the world like a plague of locusts. Please, you're scaring the children. Better to slit their throats now than let them suffer at dark spawn hands. There! Oh no, it's so mal over again. Us. This man bears their evil stench. Can you not see the vile blackness that fills him? Is no one going to shut this madman up? Be my guest. I've no urge to try out that axe of his. I watched the Black Horde descend on my people. Darkness swallowed the marshes whole. This minion is but the first of those who will destroy us. Don't be a fool. Darkspawn can be defeated. No, I have seen them. You cannot run. You cannot fight. Ooh, it does have a big axe. You poor man, what happened to you? My family, my clan, those creatures butchered them all. Some of us fled here, but we cannot escape the dog spawn. That's been horrible. How did you escape? No, I won't listen to the words of a man tainted by dog spawn. Hello, the evil, please. Fun to talk to me. I ran. Hearing my wife's screams as they dragged her off. This one point of persuasion is really paying off. Scaring these people won't get her back. You... You are right. I will go. Bye. <laughs> there he goes sliding he off screen. Right, wasn't he? There's no hope for us. There's always hope. Master your courage. You're right. We can't give up. Oh my god, there's one we point of persuasion. Up. So good. What are we supposed to do? We can't lie down and die either. We must go north to Denerim. Descend upon us! <laughs> Who's screaming that? Just ground? <laughs> Maybe there's a worm down there somewhere screaming at me still. I can't believe I'm not getting any experience points for this though. Doing all these good deeds, I'm getting nothing for it. Oh! I should sell my crap. 
I should have done something. Okay, Morgan, you can come back. You can come back. Come back Indeed. Morgan. Indeed. Who's selling the stuff? It's you, merchant. Uh, before that, though, what if I just take it? Interest for. Oh, God. Huh. Don't suppose you're looking to buy something. Sure, I am, indeed. All right. Just don't buy everything up. That's a weird, weird complaint. Don't buy too much stuff, please. Please, sir, don't buy all my stuff. Don't give me money, please. They seemed flat. Bled. <laughs> Red. <laughs> Do I need that? I don't think I need that. Oh, it's, um, Tier 2 Greatsword. I think I might know someone who would want that, right? This sword is really good. Borrowed Longsword? I can't sell that. The Warden Longsword, though? I guess maybe it's good. No. I'll keep it fine. Uh, is there a reason why I wouldn't use a uh, long bow? I suppose a short bow. I feel like there's some stats on these weapons that aren't shown here. Like, what would I use this short bow when I can use a long bow? Right? It's just more range. More damage. Oh, hang on. Uh, crit is different. I don't know, the longbow just seems better, even though the shortbow is apparently tier 3. I don't get it. That was stuff. That was pretty bad stuff. What is this arrow? It's not worth anything, apparently. <laughs> Give away arrow. I don't think you needed ammo to, to fire bows in this game, so what is what is that about? Um, sell that. Ooh, uh, tier 2. Might have been good. I don't know. These boots might be good. Tier 2, tier 2. Oh, hang on. That might be better than my armor. Yeah, it is. It is. I think I'm only, mostly selling the tier 1 stuff now. Yeah. yeah. Ooh, hang on. What's the damage against Darkspawn? Nah. I don't know. I guess I should check on my yeah, shields to see if anything is better before I sell anything. See the doggo though, they could definitely use the paint. I'm gonna I'm gonna like get more capacity by equipping this. Yep, apparently the war paint weighs something. I guess it's a bunch of paint I'm carrying. Maybe that's it. Even though I'm basically putting a design on it, right? What's a shield like? Tier 2, no effects. D4 defense. Oh, this one's good. Avards Aegis. Yeah, that's really nice. I think I can sell everything else here. Yeah, I'm good. How about the armor? Uh, I can probably keep one good armor. But everything else I could probably sell. Oh, hang on, that's a leather armor, that's good. I can't wear it. Oh, I need more strength for it. Ah, oh, frig. I haven't been leveling strength at all. Didn't realize I had to. Huh. Don't suppose you're looking to buy something. I am. All right. Just don't buy everything up. Oh my god, image management is gonna be so annoying. So, so, so. Get out of here! I don't need this junk. What's the best here? Oh, it's the same. I guess maybe I should sell the splint mail, though, because it, uh, I have chainmail boots. Can I only send one of these? That would be nice. Yes, one. Thank you. That's a full set of chainmail. Yeah, cool. That'll be good for what's-his-face. Surveyor. I could think I could just sell this uh, jewelry. Maybe I'll regret it. Hopefully not. <laughs> Excellent. And then there's all this stuff here, which is gonna take up space. Uh, I, I, I'm so encumbered right now. I can't really tell like what I'm being encumbered by. I think we said last time I can just sell gems, right? And anything that just seems valuable. 
But anything that's marked gift, I should keep that. Wolf belts a lot. Blank vellum. That's gotta be important for something. Enchantment, right? For sure. Oh god, there's more weapons. Uh, the axe. Is that good for anyone? I don't think so. Sell it. For a long time. You know what? Sell. So it's sold. It's sold. Get out of here. It's sold. I don't need this stuff. I don't. I don't need these contingencies. You know, what? I'm just gonna decide one. I'm gonna decide on the short bow. Sell. Oh, feels good to be decisive about this imagery stuff. I need to keep the rest of this stuff. What do crystals do? Oh, are they like um, sockable gem things? Is that what they are? Alright, now I can steal from me. What did I get though? Oh, did I just get a ton of stuff though? Do you get like multiple things when you steal? Hang on, what is this bow I got? What? <laughs> Wait a second. Did you steal a tier 7 bow? With like three times the damage of my current dagger. <laughs> 52 rate. This seems really good. Oh, well, good. I guess stealing is really good. I should steal from everyone. This is a good lesson. Man, I didn't think you would be able to get something that good. Have you seen my mother? There's like no consequence of not stealing either, right? I may as well. That depends. Who's your mother? She's really tall. And she has red hair. We live on a big farm hold, all of us. Some main men with swords came. A mother told me to run to the village as fast as I could, so I did. She said she'd be right behind me, but I've been waiting and waiting and I can't see her. Uh, very well, good luck with that now. Um, come with me, I'll help uh, look for your mother. How about mother said I wasn't to go with anyone. I'm supposed to wait for her here, in the village. Go to the challenge, child. Someone look after you. I will, but only if I don't find mother first. So, um, are you really an elf? Uh, did he just give me away? Father says elves aren't very nice. Wow. But you're nicer than everybody here. Thank you for helping me. You're welcome, even though your family are el elf racists. <laughs> so let's talk about your mother for a moment. I'd rather talk about your mother. Well, there's nothing to talk about. And besides, isn't your mother a scary witch who lives in the middle of a forest? Much more interesting. To you, perhaps. You would find the moss growing upon a stone interesting. You know what's more interesting than that? Apostates, mages outside of the tower. That's illegal, you know. You did not read that in a book somewhere, did you? I hope the small letters did not strain you over much. Oh, we could not talk about your mother. That works for me. Steal from his temple. Oh, what did I get? What did I get? I wish it was a bit more clear about what it gave you when you were stealing. It just seems like it just basically fills inventory stuff most of the time. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna pick up uh, whatever is in this box here, and uh, I think we'll save here and call the stream today, and we'll continue next stream, which I think will be on Tuesday. Wows will will be out by then, but you know I go, I can take three hours time off from Wow. I'm I'm sure I'll be fine. Oh my God, I'm stealing, steal for everyone. This is great. I guess we'll have lots of uh, people to steal from next time. Um, we'll be exploring this town a little bit. Take all the cool quests. And uh, I, I guess the, the real Dragon Age kind of starts here. Maybe we'll get started with the, the mage stuff uh, next time as well. Maybe. Oof. Everyone's looking forward to that, I'm sure. I am. <laughs> Can't wait. Anyway. Uh, thank you all for joining the stream tonight. Hope you had a good time. It was a lot of fun playing some Dragon Age with you all. Um, see you all on Tuesday. Big easy, everyone. Good night. See ya.
Bye-bye. Have a good one.